today we're going to make an awesome volcano. And this stuff we're going to use for the volcano. We have soap, vinegar, and baking soda. And we have a, a cup, fruit coloring, and another cup. That's a measuring spoon, right? A measuring spoon. So, and we're gonna do it. the way we're going to do this is we'll begin with our liquids. We're going to put just a dash of liquid soap in here. Why are we getting liquid? Yep. A little bit of food coloring. Squirt. You want to squeeze? Yeah. Cool. That's enough. Just takes a little bit. And we're doing a double dose. So we're going to use a whole cup of vinegar. We didn't do this. No, we sure didn't. That's because that's our other reactant that will neutralize this, the acid. This is known as a neutralization reaction. So we're going to start by pouring all that stuff in. And now, I probably should have had the cap out, but I'm going to go ahead and put my hand over this, give it a shake. And really, I think we'd benefit from even a little more vinegar because that didn't seem like a ton. So we'll give it maybe a cup and a half total. Okay. And yeah, back up just a little bit so I can pour in here. It won't matter if I spill a little because that's the point. So notice we do have something to contain most of it. We have a covering over our floor just in case it gets on our floor. We don't want to mess up the wood. And now, because we added a little more than a cup, we're going to put quite a bit of baking soda in here too. It's a new box, so it may be a little difficult to get out of here. But, here we go. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay. So we've got it in there. Now, I'm going to give it a good shake, and it's going to start coming out. Here we go. You ready for the shake? No. Ah! So we've got to clean up our floor. That was a great video, guys. Bye.